going on YouTube? Welcome to We Sibs West Coast, East Coast Siblings, where we break down your favorite movies and TV shows. Guys, Spider-Man No Way Home. The trailer just dropped. Oh boy. The trailer just dropped. We're going to break it down and react to it. Uh, so you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell so you don't miss. And let's dive right into it. What was your initial reaction? My initial re I'm super excited. So anyway, what I think... <laughs> I'm super excited, man. Fudge, I love Spider-Man. I almost forgot that he was my favorite comic book hero when I was growing up. And I think seeing all these heroes come together is really just... Really get my well, let's be clear. There going. were not a multitude of heroes coming together. It was actually villains. No, that but were I coming. okay. But here's the thing, right? There's no reason to have these other hero, uh, these other villains there if their other Spideys aren't coming. Everybody okay? knows there are already other spider mans exactly. in the movie. Exactly. So don't don't play with my emotions, <laughs> making me feel crazy. No Lord. one's doing that. Anyway, so the trailer starts out giving us a lot more information story wise about what's going on. Even though we already knew that it would have to do with a botch spell that Peter Parker basically goes to Doctor. Strange in order to get the world to forget that Peter Parker is Spider-Man and in doing that they open up a bridge to the multiverse. Now we you know the, the Doctor Strange sequel is going to be Multiverse of Madness so right. this Spider-Man movie is going to play and tie in much more into that movie but it's nice to get a little Spider-Man microcosm because I think um, even before the MCU and people wanted multiverses of Spider-Man there were already like two different versions of Spider-Man that people that wanted to see cross over. Yeah, and you know what's really interesting? Disney didn't do any of this until they completely bought Fox. But here's the thing, right? Not Fox, Sony. I know the Spider-Man movie. They didn't Sony. buy Sony. They, I know that they didn't buy Sony. Shut up. Anyway, <laughs> what they did was, they were like, listen, Tom Holland Spider-Man is going to be it. So, Sony, if you want to get on the train, you better get on now. And Sony's Tom like, Holland Spider-Man is Sony Spider-Man. Oh, touche. Yeah, so... Shut up. <laughs> Anyway, anyway guys, listen, I'm really excited, okay? All my favorite baddies are back. William Defoe's the Green Goblin, and I'm super Honestly, excited. Honestly, I don't know why so people are so excited about the Doc Ock. I'm way more excited about Goblin. He yeah, was totally my favorite. Agree. I mean, the acting by it's Willem scary. Defoe yeah. was just off the chain, and we still haven't seen his face yet, and yeah. even the Goblin glider scene that we saw was animated, so I'm worried yeah. about that. I know he's a little bit older now, probably True. can't do as much of the physical stunts, but I'm way more excited. I mean, all they had to do... I flipped they not when i saw that, the claws yeah. all you had to see was the pumpkin bomb yeah all the, all yeah the pumpkin bomb and i was like Aah! yeah exactly because you know these characters are coming um but yeah. obviously you even have some of the minor villains like uh electro jamie fox is returning yeah. as well as sandman, um, sandman which was really cool to which see which makes you wonder i mean we know venom is coming but is the toby mcguire mm. ver version of venom coming are we going to get some tover grace in there mm, uh, definitely not yeah I definitely doubt not it. I doubt it. but you know I we're going to go with the there. sony venom for sure especially yeah. have have you seen Sony's Venom yet? Yeah, I saw it. Okay, right. So at the end of that movie, it I'm gave stupid. us a perfect segue into the next Spider-Man movie. So um, they're holding on to a couple of things. Obviously, they're holding on to the uh, Tobey Maguire Spider-Man and the Andrew Garfield uh, for later on. And then obviously, I don't think they're Venom. ever going to have a trailer revealing them. No, they won't. No, they're not. No, they won't. They want to leave people on the edge of their seats until yeah. that very moment. But we know it's going to be so there. Um, we got a semi. I mean basically legit photos of them already um, on set together in the three different suits and do we it's think be awesome. another question do we think we're gonna get James Franco James Jane Franco Fran <laughs> I don't think know we're who gonna that get is. James Franco's hobgoblin James Franco is um, <laughs> do we think we're gonna get some hobgoblin? yeah I think we already saw that no in the trailer I didn't yeah who yeah you did where he's lying no I'm not all we saw was uh, what's his dad's name Bernard <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? Os Harold Osborne. No, Harold. Dad. We're talking about Harry and Norman. No, Norman. There we go. We oh my saw Norman. God! But I really, I don't know if we're gonna see William Wilhelm Defoe's face. Check it. Check it out. We can't this show you this. Is Hobgoblin. Leader. But do we think that that's just oh, oh, that's, or that's, is that the goblin from yeah, Andrew Yeah, that's Garfield's? Andrew Garfield's yeah. goblin. You can already tell the mech suit uh, like the looks way more like, like that. Yeah. He was a rough Whoa, that's so mean. <laughs> I didn't say anything about him. Just the way that like the suit looks is ugly. I'm sorry. It was way more mechanical. These are the ones that we saw um, in Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man. So yeah. definitely a lot of villains. Remember, these are just the ones that they're showing. Yeah. But I think this is going to be a charcuterie board of, of yeah, I think so. Marvel That's a big villains. word for you charcuterie board. You know what that is? I obviously did because I use it contextually in, in a sentence. I don't think, so. you, I don't think that's... 
Get out of that. here. Anyway, Spider Man is going to be incredible. I'm not too sure whether I like the armored suit with mm. the the spider claws. I know that's kind of it's a cool suit. It's a great suit, mm. um, but. I kind of wanted to see him doing all that in the regular Spider-Man suit. But at the same time, we have to remember, they have to find a way to make Tom Holland distinct from these other giants who played Spider-Man. Yeah, and like they kind Maguire of still have to pull in the Tony Stark element of it because in this version, that is his mentor. He does still have a lot of Tony stuff, you know. Yeah. So. And then finally, I do want to talk about uh, what Tom Holland said about the future of Spider-Man. So basically, he said that when they were shooting this movie, they were treating it as if it were his last time out. As, as the only Spider-Man. Um, uh, usually trilogies is as far as it gets. I think we have yet to have a fourth oh, of any movie. Oh, yeah. Ragnarok. But I think that was the first one. Yeah. That was the first superhero yeah, movie is. to get a fourth movie. It was well, kind of... Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. you want to count the Avengers. No, 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 no. I mean, like, you one like single... single right, because that's more like yeah. a franchise yeah. type thing. But, yeah. Um, so, I think... Inside Marvel, they're treating everything as a trilogy right now. And so Tom Holland said it was very emotional on set because it felt like it was a last hurrah. Um, he said that if Spider-Man did come back in his own single movie besides like being featured in Venom or heading up mm. the Avengers, that it would be a completely a complete departure from all three of the Spider-Man movies that we've, we've gotten. But Here's my thing with that, right? What is the point of casting a baby Tom Holland as Spider-Man if we're not going to grow with him? I mean, yeah, we Christian, definitely... Well, it's we, not we even... We can't go in it. That would be ridiculous. Well, no, no, no. It's, it's no question. We will see more Tom Holland as Spider-Man. Yeah. In no way, shape, or form is it supposed to mean this is the end of his Spider-Man. Yeah. It just may be a role much like, like Tony Iron Man. Tony Stark was around a long time after Iron Man 3. Yeah, but I mean, so. Spidey's got so many awesome stories to tell you. Oh, yeah, and I think he will, and I think that's, like you said, that's why they went so young um, yeah. with the casting. Uh, but, you know, he's got the Uncharted series that he's doing now, and so Uncharted. he's got a lot, he's turning into a big movie star, and he's going to have a lot of franchise. What's, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> Did you say Uncharted? No! no. I said Uncharted! Oh. Yeah, you don't know, because you All don't right, know anyway, about culture. Basically, I want to point out, okay... Alright, that's the end of this okay, episode. Wait, wait. No, I'm done. I want to point out, as a huge fan of Spider-Man, I love Tobey Maguire's movie. He's you said favorite. you almost Shh. forgot you even liked Spider-Man. Yes, what? I did forget, but I re-remembered recently. <laughs> And you don't I'm have to just say really re shut up. <laughs> I'm really excited about the nods, all the nods that they're going to give to the original spider mans Obviously, I know the Tobey Maguire one's the best, but I, you know, my respect for Andrew Garfield, whatever his movies. I'm not going to remember like the the shots as well, except for the one. I where remember all of them. Zendaya falling, and I was like, "Yo, they they gonna try to kill Mary Jane?" It ain't really. Gonna happen, no, because it didn't happen like no, that. It didn't with happen. Yeah, if but it were the nod, Glenn. I appreciate. So yeah. I also appreciated the nod with. Um, Doctor Strange standing on top of the train while it's going and Spider-Man doing down and looking up. I was like, Spider-Man 2, baby. Yeah, it's and us. I definitely think that Andrew Garfield should totally hop into McGuire's universe in order to get Gwen. They didn't cast a Gwen. Yeah, they oh, did. Oh, they totally did. Yeah. You know, they also casted a Mary Jane for McGuire. I mean, yeah, for, for Garfield. Garfield. Yeah, yeah, it's Shane, mm -hmm. Cheyenne Woodley. Yeah, Cheyenne Woodley, but she yeah. never, she, she did some did. screen tests, but she never made it into now, a film. So it's like, she don't got time for Yeah, A-Rod, you know, yeah. she's too busy with Rogers. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that's a quick reaction and breakdown of the new Spider-Man No Way Home trailer. Let us know what you oh, think. Oh, wait, sorry. Yeah. One last thing. Sorry, one last I'm, thing. I'm, like, right here, in I, the I know. outro, I'm so though. sorry. Here's the thing, though, right? What? If, here's the thing. So, good outro. I know. You're doing great. Ugh. Here's the thing. Multiverse of Madness is obviously connected to this, right? So yeah. my question is, how will No Way Home end? The multiverse situation can't be fixed. So, are we going to have an open ending? Like no, it's just going to be like, it's Doctor Who cracking the wall. It'll be like part one and part two. No, no, it's it's not going to end in Doctor Strange. They are opening the multiverse. I think it's going to be part it. one and part two. No. I mean, who knows what's going to happen after Doctor Strange. I don't think part it, two it, is going to close it. It's open and it's open for gonna, good. Yeah, I think they're going to be book, you know, kind of booky. Things. I don't think so. It's yeah, not just, bookends, This but. is the next major arc in the MCU, yeah, bringing in everybody yeah. from Galactus and Silver Surfer yeah. to the X-Men, etc. They're going to use the mess out of this multiverse. It's cracked open, we saw it in Loki, and it's staying open. There's going to be no fixing this problem um, at all. Yeah, oh, I guess you're right. But here's my, how are they going to deal with the, like, uh, the other spider man They just put up... Are they going to send them back? Yeah. Yeah, maybe because yeah, there's also thing. Sinister Six that Sony's right. working on, so exactly. probably, not. probably not. These guys are being Morbius. brought Morbius. I forgot about him. He's coming it's, too. Yeah. Mobius. Mobius. 
Jared Leto. He's coming, guys. <laughs> Keep an eye out. He was the Joker, and now he's a bad. We, we know. We actually watched Shut this. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, right, guys, we're done. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I know it's been a while since we teamed up on this. Sydney's in New Jersey right now, so maybe we get a couple episodes. You know, let's, let's do some stuff. Anyway, Lock and Key's coming up. I got you. I know I'm late, but I got you. Also, Gossip Girl on the 25th. I got you for that. We all know that show sucks, but I'm going to be there. For Let you. us know what you thought of the trailer down in the comments below. Also, guys, comment. I already said that. Subscribe. Click the bell so you don't miss as we cover your favorite movies and TV shows. I'm tired. I'm Chris. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.